Okay, rendering tutorial. I've recorded this like six times. Anyways, I just started out with the base colors. <laughs> to do the blush, I like to just go a little bit more red and darker and play with it until I feel like it looks good. You know, whatever. Um, I apply it to the cheeks and like the nose and then I take the original skin color and just put that on the nose to highlight it. And for the shadows, um, since his skin is a little bit darker and red, I like to do a really like deeper like red color for it. And I just apply that in like a slightly more right facing light for this version, for this drawing. Then I like to add some blue in the shadows. I mix it with the shadow color and to get it more desaturated. And then with the selection tool, I select out some places and just color it in. And now for highlight, um, I like to go a little bit yellow and just really light and just apply it on the nose, around the nose, around the mouth, on the lips and under the eyes. Now onto the eyes. I do a layer above the line art. And then I just fill in the eye color and then I take a darker color. I used brown because I never really use black and just fill in the lash line and then do the shadows with it as well. And then I just place highlights and shadows wherever I feel like they look good. I like to do red in the iris and blue in the shadows and eyelashes. Then I use the darker color I use on the eyes and just touch up some areas of the line art. The hair I use the selection tool again and select out some shapes. Fade it out with original hair color. Then I do a gray for the highlights, another lighter gray, and then another lighter color on top of that. Then I merge my layers. And using the liquify tool, I fix it up until I like it. Remember to flip your canvas. And then I do some finishing touches, and here it is.